All right, we're going to be solving for the missing dimension on this cone here, and we're solving for the radius, so we're going to do some serious math here. Here we go. I'm going to plug in my volume, which is 200, just plugging in my pieces. One third pi. I don't have r, so I still have r squared. I'm going to need to find that. And I do have my height, so I'm going to plug in my 10. Okay, first thing I'm going to do, just like solving for the height, I'm going to get rid of this one third. I'm going to multiply each side by 3. That's going to cancel out the one, the one third there and the 3. And 3 times 200 is going to get me 600. And I still have left on this side pi r squared and 10. The pi and the 10 are multiplying to the r squared. I want to get the r squared by itself, so let's divide them off. Divide by that on the other side. Plugging that in real quick. So 600 divided by parentheses. Got to have the parentheses. Pi, 10, and parentheses, and then hit enter. So about 19.1. I'm going to leave that number on my calculator because I don't want to get rid of it. I don't want to round wrong. It's about 19.1. And that equals r squared. That is not r. We need to take the square root in order to get the, the correct answer. And it's going to be about. But here's why I didn't get rid of it on the calculator. So when I take the square root, I'll have a really exact answer. I can type in this exact number a few digits. That should be good, plenty, and let's see what we get. So about 4.4. 4.4 .4. 4 .4 millimeters. Southwest 212, St. Paddy's Day.